I had a student once who said, isn't trading a bit like clairvoyancy and reading tea leaves? Yes, that's right, people. People think that um, it's a bit of a myth when people get things right in crypto. And I can only say that the only reason I picked this point, the 20,800 on Bitcoin, was because we'd been there before. So if we go back through the chart to this price, I mainly chose the 20,800 because we treated this as support previously. And there is an age old known um, factor when it comes to trading of support and resistance. So I can stick this in there and there you go. We support very well on that line. We do disrespect it at some points. We go straight up and come all the way back down and we keep following that. And here we are, we're heading straight back to the 20,800 era. It's one of the reasons why I picked the 1,280 on Ethereum. And it's another reason why I chose 1,380 on Ethereum. But when we got to that price, you know that if I was trading and I was buying this price, when we hit 1,380, I was in the trade. So you can imagine what I did. So anyway, trading crypto is a little bit like tea leaves and a little bit like clairvoyance, is that you can predict what's going to happen based on history. And they say history doesn't repeat it rhymes and that's exactly right in crypto now we've got to this price so quickly as a trader i have no idea what to do <laughs> so all i can do is say right we've gone very quick from the bottom to the top we have printed over 20 percent in ethereum just in the last four days and typically when something goes up that far it has to come back down but if we go back through the chart and look at the 1700 area this is where we were before and if we zoom out we came down from two thousand dollars to 17 $1,700. Yep, so we came down back up to $1,700 and we fell to 1300 How did we get to $1,700? We came up from $1,000. That's right. <laughs> what an incredible increase. So we went from $1,000 to exactly where we are now. We took a dip. Then we went to $1,700. So now as a trader, I'm saying to myself, we've got back to $1,500. There's a good chance we'll come back down to the $1,400 area, which is where I think we'll close at the end of the month before heading back up to $1,700. Let's see how this plays out. Keep watching and I'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye.